Good evening, I'm meteorologist Karen Williams, and we're in this pattern in which we're just getting rounds and rounds of showers. It's just the one, two, three everyday showers, and this is going to be this progression of the pattern for as far ahead as we can see, unfortunately. Now going out the door for your Monday morning, it's going to shape up like this. We'll have mostly cloudy skies, 42 degrees. One or two, you might see a little bit of drizzle to start. Then by 1 p.m. we'll still have those showers around 47 degrees and we keep the showers around by 5 p.m. at 48 degrees. Now looking at our radar from earlier, you can see in this blue gray area here, we have a winter storm watch and that will be in effect until Thursday. And as we kind of widen out the view here, this purple area is a winter uh, advisory, winter weather advisory, and that's for parts of Mount Shasta and Weaverville and Bernie. So those areas there that are at the higher elevations, you can see some wintry mix type of precipitation. As we go out to the coast of Eureka here, you're looking at only rain and some of that will be light to moderate in nature. As we go ahead and put our future tracker into motion, you can see you see a lot of blue on this map, but again, you'll see the green here and then that pink and that is the wintry mix that we were talking so much about. And notice Tuesday, we still get a pretty much a secession. Looking at late Tuesday into Wednesday, another set, another system is lining up. So again, it's just going to be that one, two, three rotation for as far ahead as we can see. Now, as we advance a little bit further here, our rain chances, it's going, you're going to need that rain gear all this week. And we're not seeing any breaks whatsoever. In fact, Wednesday will be the heaviest chance for our rain situation here. So again, this is going to be one of those wet weeks going forward. Look at the high temperatures for tomorrow, 49 to degrees for Klamath and 49 for Crescent City. As we go down to our south, Willow Creek at 46 degrees and the high tomorrow down to our south, Red Bluff at 51 degrees, Redding at 49 and Laytonville at 45 degrees. Now looking at that marine forecast, we are in a small craft advisory in effect till Tuesday evening. And then we have northwest winds 5 to 15 knots, waves northwest 15 feet every 14 seconds, and we will have chances of showers. Then for your Monday, we're looking at southwest winds 5 to 15 knots becoming south 15 to 25. So that's going to be a significant chop there. We still keep those showers around. We have our sunrise time at 740 a.m. and your high tide and your low tide times. For your forecast, we'll have evening showers. It will be damp, 39 degrees. And then for tomorrow, cloudy skies, showers likely 48 degrees. And now we're looking at your seven day forecast. Again, we keep those showers in play every day this week. Temperatures will be in the upper 40s to low 50s. And looking at your inland forecast, we're looking at that wintry mix. Temperatures in the upper 30s and into the 40s all week.